Hey everyone, Arch Shadow here, and welcome back to Blush Blush. So previously, we had a new phone fling with Seth, who's pretty much like the devil. And let's see... Yeah, I'm... I'm getting there. Just seven more hours. But... Yeah, until then... And I'm about halfway... A little less than halfway to getting a laptop for Ichiban or Anon. Probably Anon since he was kind of here first. Oh, and I guess. And man, the farmer job needs 50. It's like, geez, and I thought this one was a lot. Man, though, well. In due time, I hope. Anyways, yeah, so I guess if I'm not at like close to level 50, I'm at level 45 almost with these jobs or with these hobbies. So I'd like to hope that in time I will get to that point. And as long as I use my diamonds a little more wisely now. Anyways, enough talk. So let's see here. Alright, ready for round two. I've been ready for about a whole day now. Be warned, these questions will only get more challenging as we go. What can be lost, but not returned? <laughs> okay, my mind just... Uh, yeah, my mind went somewhere. Oh, yeah, the answer is life. That copy of your favorite video game that you loaned a friend before they lost it and moved away? Yeah, or like that kid who took Mario Kart Double Dash out of my backpack at school one day. Yeah, it's like, as you can see, I'm still bitter about it. I mean, I was able to buy another copy later, but, well, anyways. I'm gonna say that yes, the answer is life itself. Because you can lose your life, and after that, it's like, you're done. You're done, son. There's no going back. Yes, it is. Especially since life is so fragile. Because once life is taken away, it becomes mine. And I'm very greedy, you see. Congratulations. You've successfully survived another one of my questions. And here, I thought this would be an easy game to win. For who? For you or for me? Because so far it's like, I'm winning. You're continuing to impress me with each... Ah, pfft. You're continuing to impress me with each answer. So I'll give you an even better reward. How long is this one going to take? Another picture as a gift. But... You get to pick one thing that you'd want me to take a picture with. Okay. So if I wanted you to take a picture of you hugging a giant stuffed Barney doll, would you do it? Well, obviously that would be too specific for this game. Choose wisely and make it count. Let's see here. Hmm, how hot is it down there? Think you can find anything cold? And just as tasty as you. Let's see. What's cold and creamy found in a freezer and comes in many flavors? Oh yeah, well, what's white and gold and can't keep a secret to save his life? Then let's take a closer look behind that mask! I bet none of you will get that one. Unless you... It's like, unless you were a fan of all the stuff I liked when I was younger. Although it's like, I've given away that answer, just in many other different videos. 
Hmm. Giving me a riddle in return. Not, <clears throat> not exactly the riddle of the Sphinx, but I'll play along. Something cold that you can eat. It's the banana! No. Like ice cream. Yeah, because bananas don't come in different flavors. There's either banana flavor or organic banana flavor. Or not ripe banana flavor. Which is... Ugh. Man. See, like ice cream. In the underworld! And here, I thought I was playing... I was the one playing the mind games. Or <clears throat> oh man, let me see. Let me read that again. Something cold that you can eat. Like ice cream. In the underworld! And here, I thought I was the one playing mind games. But a deal is a deal. Let me see what I can do for you, dear human. Okay, and... Now I have to wait two whole days for that one. I guess let's have a look-see here. Seriously, he looks like he's ready to join Team Magma. And that he's a supporter of... either the Goma Spiders or the Borok Swarms. Whichever one, I don't know. Although that's probably more like a Goma. <laughs> Alright, well then, and yeah, as I mentioned, event going on for something that I don't know if I can even show because YouTube has been getting on my case a lot lately. Alright, well, see you all in the next segment. Later. Hey everyone, so welcome back to Crash, er, to Blush Blush. And yeah, so enough time has passed. I was able to catch up with Will here, and on the side, I managed to unlock the final guy, who I don't know if I will start in this segment, considering at least how weird it is already, considering I'm recording this in segments, at least to me. Lovely to see you. I can possibly get further with Sterling, in fact. You know, maybe I might just try that off the bat. Well, actually, first let's see here. Okay, so I can't do a million bones. And let's see. Uh, hey there. The laptop. How much am I away? Ugh. Jeez, I am so close. It's like, why? Just, why? I guess while I'm at it, here are the hobbies so far. And I looked it up, and it seems that the maximum is 70, so I guess I wasn't too far off. And I also became a politician. Yeah, so... At the very least, I can start on this one. Or at least I have started on it, and I'm already a bit ways into it. If you remember, it said that I needed 20 before, but now I got it down to 18. Okay, well anyways, let's get back with Seth. Alright. I shall deserve major kudos when I share my success. For I have done what no philosopher could do. I defied a snowball's chance in hell, and made a popsicle. Okay. Yeah, well... It's like, um, sure. I guess, for anyone who's into that, sure. As you bid me. Huh, you actually made some ice cream. I love a man who's dedicated. Did you really make that? Out of what? Out of the blood of my enemies. Okay, no. It's like, how did you defy the laws of physics? Well, souls. 
Okay, I was kind of close. I said the blood of his enemies. The only thing I know how to cook are souls and pineapple pizza. You are sinful! Which is a dish native to hell, obviously. Yep, depending on who you ask. You know I'm quite... You know, I'm growing quite fond of you. I haven't had this much fun since playing a riddle game. Uh, I hadn't had this much fun playing a riddle game since that one time I met Galileo. But let's say we go all for nothing this last round. If I win, I get your soul. But I also want your phone. What? Well, at the very least, I could not see us losing, so... It's like, yeah, without the phone, then we obviously wouldn't have any more phone flings. But my whole life is on my phone! That's a weird thing to want. What are you planning? Are you gonna make a bunch of prank phone calls off this phone? And then blame it on me? Because that is so evil! Oh, nothing too exciting. Maybe just looking to upgrade. Really? Well, then what kind of phone are you using? What kind of phone is this, for that matter? <laughs> or maybe I've got something nefarious up my sleeves. I'm rather tricky like that. Because if I win, I'm not only going to take your soul as a prize, but I'm also going to take the souls of all the boys you've texted! <laughs> Oh boy. Oh, I see where he's going. So it's like, he's got me, pretty much, so now it would just be a matter of getting this phone, that way he could get everyone else. You'll basically be doing my soul farming for me. No! You might be a sexy silver-haired demon that I want badly, but I can't let you do that! That's evil! Er. Let me see, can I try it? Eva! Okay, oh my god. That has to be probably one of the loudest recording things on the mic, just looking at it. Evil! Evil, 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 evil! Ah! See, that's evil! And kind of hot with how evil that is. Um, you know what? Considering I just did the Mermaid Man, evil. It's like yeah. Considering I went the extra mile, I might as well go with it. If I make the joke, I'm gonna go with it. Evil and exciting. I'm excited for a change and. The people I see wandering down here. You know, it's a little dark, a little gloomy, and hey, it's full of dead people. There's nothing more delicious in hell than the undeserving. But I'm not forgetting about your prize either. If you win, I'll send you pictures that will spur your fantasies. Something that I personally find fun, but something you'll enjoy marveling at. But also, I'll let you keep me in your contacts, in case you ever want the company of the Underworld. What do you say? Are you willing to go all in? I don't think I have a choice. Yeah. It's like, considering though. Ah, considering the way the phone flings work, it's like I don't have a choice in this. I have to protect all my best boys! Alright, fine. Count me in, you evil, sexy demon! Because he's evil! And that is why I find you so fascinating. Never backing down from a challenge. I'm excited for your impending loss. I can be blind. I can be tough. You cannot buy me, but I can be stolen with a single glance. It is harder to give this to yourself, 
but easier to give to others. A tough glance? A blind glance? I don't know. What am I? Let's see what it says. What is law? <laughs> you know, this would actually be a, an appropriate spot to slot in the, bur the Burger King on fire singing What is Love? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. It's like, as it is, he's already in hell singing that song, so why not? Well, I'd love to give you a straightforward answer, but that'd be too easy. Nope, like I said, I'm, I made the joke, so I'm taking it. What is love is correct. And, I shall add, for the sake of consistency, Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. <laughs> See, it's like, this stuff writes itself. Well, technically, no, the, the people who write the game write this, so... I'm just going off of what they write as a springboard. It seems as though you've vested me. A shame. I was really looking forward to having you as my own. But a deal is a deal. I owe you your prize. I'll just be a moment, so don't wander too far. Alright, well then, I guess. I have to wait three whole days for this. But I think this is already enough for an episode. And who knows, considering how this has been going so far, Maybe in three more days, I can actually finally get that damn laptop. I swear, it's like, first it was the vacuum cleaner, now it's the damn laptop. And the worst part is, I have to do it twice. And then, it's like, did I forget to mention I need to get that florist job? Well, you know, in theory, I could do that, I just have to... But then I still need this job, too, so... Well, anyways, yeah, I guess in theory I can do it. I just have to... Turn this off, maybe turn off one of these, and then... Boom, I got it. Okay, well, anyways... Yeah, like I said, I'll leave it at that, then. So next time, I guess we're gonna finish things off with Seth. And then... Hopefully, maybe get more forward with either Annan or Sterling. At least those are my plans, anyway. Mix, unfortunately. Well, ugh. Okay, you know what? I'll do it then. I'll do it. At least as far as I know, no one wants the politician job anyway. And plus, it's like... Being a florist pays more than being a politician anyway. <laughs> okay. There. I've done it. And let's see, I'll turn that back on. So... Only 140 or 137 more rotations to go. What does he want anyway? Okay, well, yeah, I don't think I'm at that yet. Okay, well, in that case, yeah, I'll see you all next time with whatever else I do. And how strange, the the second segment actually ended up being longer than the first one. That's a first time for me. Oh well, anyways, stay golden, and later, folks.